Well, do you even find me attractive? That's cute. No, no, no. Before you got to know my awesome personality, strictly physical. First time you saw me. There's just two people talking. Yeah. Two girls over drinks at Bennigan's. Go. I liked your eyes. I didn't think I'd ever seen such big, beautiful eyes. Your lips. Yeah, thought you might be a good kisser. I am. <laughs> your breasts. What about them? They intrigued me. Really? Yeah. Oh, I think they're so tiny. Still breasts. Thanks. I liked your hands. Mouth. Butt. Voice. Chest. Eyes. You said that. I meant it. You swear you don't want anything more from me other than sex. You swear you don't want anything more from me? Oh, how you girls get tick tock, tick tock. Stop it. What are you doing? I'm pulling up my Bible app. You have a Bible app? Yes. I am a good girl. Hand in hand. I'm so glad I met you tonight. Oh, me too. What are you thinking? Just how great you are. <laughs> Annie, hey. Who the f is Annie? My sister. Better be. I'll cut her. <laughs> of course I'm coming. Yeah, I'm taking the fourth off, so. I'll be there for three days. I, I, uh... <laughs> How's dad? Any worse? All right, tell him I said hi. Bye, Banani. I want you to meet my parents. No, you really? Just... <sighs> oh, oh, God. Oh, 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 no. Oh, excuse me. Sorry. Oh, okay. Wah. Can you hand me my bag? Sure. This one. The one with the strap. Okay. okay. That's me. Which one, the blue or the yellow? Uh, no, the makeshift sign made out of lipstick. That's me. You're Dylan Harper. I am. I'm Jamie Rellis. You're picking me up from the airport. Uh, hi. Yes, I am. You always pick people up like this? Uh, yeah, you know, I like to keep things interesting. Welcome to New York. Thank you. You're not exactly what comes to mind when you think headhunter. Yeah, I prefer executive recruiter. Headhunter sounds a little creepy. You did stalk me for six months. Kind of creepy. <laughs> oh, here, here, here. I'll take it. You're really gonna carry my bag? You're that girl? No, I'm gonna change your life. I'm that girl. Okay, what about her? Uh, yeah, I could get to know her inside. She's reading a book. It's probably Nicholas Sparks. I'm gonna go talk to her. What? What do you mean what? I said we were on a date again. I'm gonna go talk to her. Now? Here, in front of all of these people? I said I was gonna rape her. I was gonna go talk to her. Well, we talked. We laughed. Yeah. She's Belgian. Oh, explains the reading. I showed her where the balcony was because that's where she is meeting up with her husband. Oh. <laughs> Anniversary trip to New York. Three kids: Christoph, Carlina, and Pepin. <laughs> Shut up. Why are you still laughing? At least I gave it a shot. Oh, fine. I'll go next. See if I still have game. Okay. Yeah. Ooh, okay. Yes. Right here, 11 o'clock, iced coffee. Handsome, but doesn't know it. Staring at a tree, which means he's actually in the park for nature and not to watch women sunbathe. Or he's retarded. Don't care. I'm going in. Bum, 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 bum.
Okay, his name is Parker. He's a children's oncologist. And I have a date this Saturday. Nice. Thank you. Why'd you, uh, why'd you wave to me? Oh, I told him you were my gay best friend, so he wants to set you up with his brother. <gasps> College. Yeah. Med school. And I haven't slept since. I can't believe you actually cure cancer. Well, me and God. What? I'm kidding. Can you imagine someone oh. would actually say that? <laughs> yeah, I could. I've been out with a lot of them. Cancer doctors? No, assholes. Yeah. <laughs> well, hopefully you're all done with that. Although I gotta warn you, a lot of cancer doctors, big assholes. Really? Yeah. Oh, and uh, and brain surgeons, huge perverts. <laughs> Are they doing this? A little bit of that. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Thank you. When can I see you again? Right now. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Can you imagine someone would actually say that? I played the tuba in high school world's stupidest instrument, especially when you move eight times. Why'd you move? My mom really likes to break up with guys, and she was really good at it. Was your dad one of them? No, no, he was long before that. I actually never knew my dad. Sorry, that sucks. All right, look, I think I should probably tell you something. Please don't tell me you're a dude, <laughs> because that'll be like the third time since I moved here, and I don't think I can handle that. I have a five-date rule. You know, like, five dates? Before we... Yeah. I saw it in a movie. Thought I'd give it a try. You're worth waiting for. I'm sure that was the line of the movie you saw. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. This four-year-old that I've been working on for the last couple of months is gonna be fine. That's great! Yeah. But how is the guy like you single? I've just been waiting for someone to come up to me in the park and compliment me for looking at the trees and not the sunbathers. Well, I meant it. It was impressive. Actually, if I'm gonna be completely honest with you... Yeah. I was sleeping, standing up. I worked 36 hours straight. I don't even know how I got to the park. <laughs> I was a girl like you, single. <laughs> oh, well, I have issues. One might even call me damaged. Actually, one did call me damaged. Get out of here. Damage how? I kind of believe in true love. But there might be a, a Prince Charming out there for me. Listen. I know this is probably a no, because all you do is work like a dull boy. But would you like to come get a beer? Ah, good. No, it's not a gay bar, and there'd be just as many hot girls as hot guys. You know what? I will come out. All right.